Hello all, welcome to this session. In this session, I'm going to answer one of the Selenium interview questions. That is, what is the difference between build and perform methods in actions class? Let me answer. In Selenium WebDriver, actions is one of the predefined class which contains the commands like a lot of commands like build, perform, many other commands, okay, which can be used for simulating or automating the mouse and keyboard actions, okay. So, here the question is all about what is the difference between build and perform methods, okay, of the actions class of Selenium WebDriver. Coming to the build command, it is used to create the chain of actions. If you want to perform multiple actions on an element, okay, for example, if you want to hover the mouse onto element, then again from there you want to hover onto, uh, I mean, again, you want to click on that element, okay, multiple actions are there, right? Not only hovering the mouse and mouse left click also you are doing, multiple actions are there. Such kind of uh, multiple actions, okay, can be chained together to work together or to combine and work together. Who combines it? Build command will combine it, but it will not execute them. It will just chain them. It will link it, combine it. But coming to the perform command, it is going to run the commands, okay, which are chained by this build command, okay. So let's uh, see these uh, things practically so that you will understand more, okay. First, I will start with the perform command. Without using build command, also we can use perform command when there is only one action, okay. If only one action is what is the use of chaining, right. If you have multiple actions to be performed, then we have to create a chain of actions. But if you have only one command, one action to be performed, then simple, we can run that particular action, single command, no need of chaining, okay. Then we can use perform. So what will happen if you don't use perform? That is also another thing that I'll cover here. So here I'll switch to this Eclipse ID where we have the sample Selenium automation code for opening the Chrome browser, for maximizing the browser, and here for opening the application URL in the browser. Let me open the application URL in the browser like uh, omega.blogspot.com is the application URL. Copy this and paste it here. Done. Okay. So once you go to this application URL, I would like to move my mouse onto the blocks. So that uh, blocks will be highlighted and this blog options, uh, this menu options will be displayed for us. And you can see this highlighting of the blocks, okay? Once I hover the mouse, this is what I want to do. So for that, what I'll do is to make that happen, first I need to create an object for the actions class. Actions, actions is called new actions like this. Put a semicolon and hover the mouse on the actions and uh, import this actions predefined class from Selenium library. And here you need to pass the driver, okay? This web driver's driver you need to pass here. That's it. Now, write down actions dot, there's a command, okay, predefined command in actions class to hover or move the mouse onto this element, that is a uh, move to element command, okay, and here we have to give the web element to which we want to move. What is the web element? The web element is nothing but this block, inspect this blocks element and create a locator for that web element for that. ID is there, copy this and create a web element for that blocks menu option, by dot ID. And uh, in double quotes, give the idea of that blocks menu option. And uh, this is a blocks menu, okay, element or whatever it is for the mouse and say create the element, okay, web element will be coming. The return type of find element is web element. This blocks menu, put it here, okay. Now, do you think this move to element command will work and my mouse will move on to this uh, blocks? It will not happen, guys, okay. I'll tell you the reason later. First, let me run this and see that uh, my mouse is not going to be hovered on the blocks menu. Okay, there is the reason. Here only one command or one action is there that is move to element action, which need to move or hover the mouse onto the blocks menu element, but it is not going to happen. You see, nothing will happen. You see, blocks, blocks is not highlighted or menu options are not coming. That means the simulation has failed. Okay, the reason behind that is to run these actions of this actions class, okay? To run move to element is one of the predefined method to perform one action, okay? Mouse action on this, uh, from this actions class or their keyboard actions also. So other keyboard actions, but move to element uh, for mouse actions. So how can we run this or execute this uh, actions of this actions class with the help of this command known as perform? Execute the actions or chain of actions. One action can be there or chain of actions also it can execute. When you say dot perform, then only 
this activity will be performed okay mouse activity or action will be performed that's the that's the you know purpose of the perform command okay of actions class okay let it run you see this time the mouse you will not be able to visually see my mouse moving here and there but uh, internally the mouse has moved and hovered onto the blocks menu you can see the blocks menu got uh, highlighted and we can see the options that's good so far without perform this is not going to happen now what i will do here is after going here i would like to hover the mouse onto another option that is selenium by our own option okay here okay for that i'll in, uh, for that i'll inspect this and uh, here i'll inspect otherwise inspect this option uh, and this looks like uh, some export expression i have to create copy this text between the tags uh, double slash a slash span of text is equal to view the text of that option and now you see it is getting located okay if it is there it can be located guys okay copy this it's locating actually you can see selenium by an option under the blocks is located here okay only one element so create a web element for that driver dot find element by dot uh, x path and provide the x path expression and uh, put a semicolon and here is a uh, selenium by our own option okay and here is a web element the return type of find element is web element and now what i'll do is i'll say actions dot similarly move to element i'll say which element once i move to blocks from there I have to hover the mouse or move my mouse onto the selenium bio. So this selenium bio, I'll give it here. Not only moving, but also I want to click on this. I want to click. Okay, I want to click on this. So I'll say click. This is mouse left click guys. Okay. Now here only one action was there, so only perform is required. Now here multiple actions are there. Move to element is a hovering action, and click is a, you know mouse left click action. So combination is there. These two should happen, okay, together. We have to chain them together. In order to chain them, we have to use this build command. Build command is not, build method or command is not going to execute or run this uh, two action commands of the actions class, but a chain will be, they will be linked together or combined together, okay? Like as a group, they will be merged together, okay, to perform together kind of build. Build means attach, attach these commands. And now I'll say perform, build is only for attaching the multiple commands, okay, to run together. Whereas dot perform is going to run these actions, okay. So that's the thing guys, that's the difference between build and command. When you have only one command, there is no need of build. When you have multiple commands or action commands, then we have to chain them together. In order to chain them together, we need build. And uh, to run them again, we need perform. Either it is one command or chained command doesn't matter perform is required to run them otherwise they are not going to run so let's see here what is going to happen this time it is going to hover first on the blocks menu after that selenium by our, uh, it is going to hover and after that it's going to click on that selenium by our own and will be taken to the selenium by our own block page just see and observe it will first hover the mouse on the blocks then selenium by our own and it will click all these things happen okay so execution is being done by perform and the chaining is being done by build command Hope you got the answer for this question in this session. So that's all for this session. Thank you. Bye-bye.